Hi, my name is Alex. This is Aaron. Today we are filming the first ever Frostbite YouTube video. We are focusing on throwing our new Dinner Bell XL, which will, boom, pop up right there. But we also have the medium size, which is usually our big size, but that's our medium size this year, and then our small one. And uh, yeah, this is new. This is going to be exciting. Hopefully you guys enjoy the new look on Frostbite fishing, Frostbite ice fishing. Say we gotta get going here. So we've made it to the first spot. Aaron is slowing us down here and we're just trying to film this video of the dinner bell and I don't know if it's gonna happen. He's been so just pokey this morning. Like he now is trying to find his dinner bells. Aaron, where are the dinner bells? What happened to the painted ones? Where's all the finals? Oh, let me tell you, we got some perfect colors that have been fine tuned over the course of the last, I don't know, nine months. Alex left every single one in Chicago. So all we have is like two brass naked dinner bells. Is there lake trout in this spot too? Uh, How's yeah. it going? Are you tired? It'll be mostly char. You shouldn't be tired. Oh my goodness. Did you see this? What happened to this char? That is a sleeping char. Sleeping char. They've come up from the ocean. They've got a long way to go. So sometimes they'll pause in the rocks here and take a nap before they complete their journey and go up and spawn up the river. Wake up, buddy. Okay. There's another napping char. That one seems like he's in a deep sleep, though. How far north are we, Aaron? We're 1,800 miles from Twin Cities, Minneapolis, but we are 1,400 miles still from the North Pole, where we are in Cambridge Bay, Nunavut. The biggest thing is the action on the spoon. It's got a middle piece that is not connected to the bait, so that way it will hit the bait and make a bunch of noise as well as make an erratic swimming action. It is a version of the JNS Demon Tongue. Actually, the owner of JNS has partnered with us, Travis. We have decided to make it out of a different metal that makes it a little bit heavier, so you can cast a spoon an absolute mile if you are open water fishing it, as well as get it down to the right depths, even though it does have an open space in there, so the spoon will do some crazy action in the water, but that's what we're after today, big char. I'm gonna use a medium dinner bell. Do we make this color? Nope. Not really. Nope, that was a reject. Was this a reject too? That's a reject too. Oh geez. That's a color we make. Yep, that color. But oh no, a... no, no. I think we X'd out green too. Here, this one Blue, we, we make sure. that color. We make this color. <laughs> We've gone through a lot of colors. Here is one of our new glow colors. It is heavier than the original dinner bell because we changed the metal. It's still not gonna be heavy enough to get a crazy long cast or to keep it deep in this current. So I'm gonna fish it on a fly rod as most of you would naturally. I'll let you do whatever you're doing with your fly rod and all that garbage. Sometimes he overcomplicates his life. And I'm just gonna go out here and show you guys how easy it is to catch a fish on the new XL dinner bell. Luckily I'm using all of Aaron's gear too, so it's like super high end stuff. Fish on. Come big on. fish, big fish. Second cast, second cast, are you kidding me? Feels good. Such a crazy scenery. There's a float plane that flew us in this morning to catch these big char and this is my second cast with the XL dinner bell. Oh my gosh, this fish is big. This fish is big. What pound test is on this? Uh, 14 liter. Lost him. Is it off? He's off, it was big. No, Alex. It can't be off, we need that fish so bad. I was so cocky. Alex, are they going ballistic when they get hooked? Yep. Fish on. Oh. Take oh, it easy, let him run. Huge red one. Especially at the start, let him do stuff. This is my third one I've hooked. Feels like an absolute brute. Try and get him out of this current. This is 100% the biggest one I've hooked. Good one to keep in, maybe. Yeah. Don't lose, oh. What on earth just happened? That is my third one, what is the issue? Well, I could guess what the issue is. Is it me? Of course it's you. Horsing them too much? I think you're not horsing them enough, Alex. Oh. Come on, be it, be the one. No rush. Okay. There's no rush. If it's pulling hard, let it pull and run. This is so different than yesterday's fish. They're so much more powerful. We are having to use a single hook, but that's just an excuse when you lose fish is, ah, oh, blame it on the hook. So the Dinner Bell XL does come with a treble hook, which is super sharp and amazing. This is my fourth char I've hooked. Hopefully it's a char. I mean, you never know what it could be. Oh, 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 oh! No way. That one got off. That was a tiny silver one. But I've lost four fish now. Alex, 
There was a massive red one sitting right here. Really? Massive red one. Like he's so obvious and close to me, I almost wonder if he's dead, but I don't think he is. That's close to him. That's very close to him. I saw a big red one jump right there. Really? Oh my goodness, I got him! No way, no way! A huge red one! Oh my gosh! Oh I my got gosh. him! Oh my gosh! Wow! Oh my gosh! Dinner bell! Easy, easy, easy! On the fly! <laughs> this is gonna be cool! We don't have a net, unfortunately. Forgot it in the plane, which is half a mile away. These fish are angry, energetic, as Alex has shown by losing four char. Oh, look at it, Alex. Can you see it? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This thing is amazing. You are not going to believe the colors. I'll just keep, you. should we just keep walking them this way? The further towards slack water we can get them, the better chance we have. Yep. Oh my gosh, dude, this thing is incredible. How bright is that so fish? So incredible. How bright, Alex. Oh my goodness. This thing is glowing. He's right at my freaking feet. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. I got him, I got him, I got him. Come and get it! Look at that red amazing char. Never seen a fly quite like that. Looks like one of our new glow dinner bells. And it contrasts very nicely with that bright red, none of it Arctic char. Oh! Watch how easy this is gonna come out after that long fight. This Arctic char has been kept in the water, is so happy and ready to go. So you try and chase them down. <laughs> All the fish I lost were silver. That was, like, that was incredible. Bright red fire truck, and there's more here. We just got started. Oh my gosh. Buddy, we just crushed it. <laughs> so good. We just crushed it. So good. Give me a high five. We just crushed that. As you guys can tell, the dinner bell has caught many different species before, but to catch an Arctic char up in literally the Arctic Circle is pretty incredible. On the fly. On the fly too. So good, so good. I've had lots of mishaps today with the single hook, but I'm not gonna let that ruin this video. I just need to catch one for, for you guys. For myself, mostly for my self-esteem. Do we switch to the tantrum? I don't think they need to see the tantrum just yet. They're not ready for it. It's just too much to handle. Is that snow right there? Oh, the first snow of the season, Alex. Finally, the first snow. It is snowing. Oh, that is so nice. Mm. I need to redeem myself after that. Poor performance. Fish on. Okay. Oh my gosh, this feels bigger. This feels bigger. Yes, this is the fish we need. Oh, it's a big red one. It's a big red one. Oh, he's not that red, but he's beautiful. Lost him. He wasn't that big. I heard it's a big red one, then I heard it's not that red, then I heard it's not that big. <laughs> okay, we're putting the drone up. We're trying everything to cater to Alex catching his first red char here. It's tough. I mean, these fish are warriors and they get to this size for a reason. They've had to avoid a lot of obstacles. And will they be able to avoid Alex for another couple hours? See him? There's lots right below me here. Okay. Just one fish would be nice. I'm going deep, I'm going, going up to my nuts here, guys. These big old red char is what I'm looking for. Alex, there's a crap load here. Okay, hold on, stay there. You're gonna get him for sure, there's a crap load. There's a crap load, Aaron says. His drone's out of control, it's his first time flying a drone. Fish on. Nice. So many here, dude. Okay, okay, okay. This could be the one, Aaron. This could be the one, Aaron. This is gonna be my seventh opportunity at a fish. I'll come in a sack. I feel like there's a good chance he's not gonna be there too much longer. What are you trying to say? You know. <laughs> Just so scary. So many rocks. The water's not deep here. It's not like we're fishing like a super like deep hole. It's only a couple feet deep, so they can get in those rocks real easily. And when they shake their head like that, it's like, what do you do, put pressure on them? Not put pressure on them? Oh no, oh no. This could be it. It's Coming. gonna be a sauce. What do you know, Alex? I've definitely got a hole in my waders. My neither regions have got some water. Oh no, oh no, don't do that. Don't do that. Oh, it's in the rocks. No. No, Alex. It's in the rock. Keep them high, keep them high, keep them high. Oh, easy, don't do that. They just do so many crazy acrobatic things when you get them close to you. 
Oh geez, don't fall in, don't fall in. Okay, I'm gonna land hopefully my first try on this video. I am throwing the dinner bell XL, the really nice fish that Aaron caught was on, the medium sized one. And we really came out here to test out this big one, but as you guys know, I forgot the dang colors in Chicago. So we're using the initial prototype with doesn't even have any paint on it. Okay, here we go. Here we go, baby. It's not red at all. It's beautiful though. Could be the line class record. Here. There we go, here we go. This is how you self-net. Come here, come here. What are the odds I land this? Zero. <laughs> <laughs> Uh-oh, what's going on here, Alex? <laughs> oh, popped off, he popped off. I still got him, yes. You could have just pinched your legs together and you would have had him. <laughs> that is what she bit, the dinner bell XL. No paint, but still doing the job out here in the Northern Arctic Circle. And this is what she looks like. That beautiful Arctic char. My biggest fish of the trip so far, probably seven pounds, maybe eight pounds. Right in the current, super fun fight. Oh yeah, bye. <laughs> Hopefully you guys enjoyed the first ever frostbite. This was the first ever? First ever. What? No, that's crazy. Brought to you guys by our newest product, the XL Dinner Bell, which comes in a variety of cool colors, not in this color because As the ice comes in the north, we will be on the very first ice of anyone on YouTube. You can guarantee that. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys could hit the subscribe button, uh, that'd be great. We just want to provide some awesome content to you guys. All these products will be available in the early days of October. And uh, we'll are you just leaving? We will catch you guys next time.